Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of FTL. Right back where we left off last episode in the Uncharted Nebula system on a one-man crew. We may not make it all alive, but here's hoping. Man, okay. You're in your repair duty, buddy. You're the only one I have. At least you don't need oxygen. This is very helpful. Why am I repairing my sensors? I don't know. This is in nebula. You don't get sensors. What I really need is more crew. As soon as possible. It's amazing that my weapon system and my shields remain online throughout that whole ordeal. It really is. So definitely first order of business is to get more crew. I need ideally I should have three at least like bare minimum I should have four more crew members. One for our weapons, one for shields, and one for engines. No, four crew members, yeah. Including the pilot, Declan. I need to have one for weapons, one for shields, one for engines. But I'm running with just the pilot right now. This is a very lonely situation for Declan. He's very sad. Although I think the Lanius are fine with solitude. So they have no idea what customs are, human culture and human customs and culture is. I love how oxygen is actually zero percent. I never actually seen that happen before. Oh, well, there's your problem. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Our hull is really bad too. We're gonna spend a decent amount of repairs. Yeah, the next shot we get to. Hopefully, you get to one soon. But, you know. Oh man. Okay. At this, this kind of these situations, I'm so glad that we have Elenius as our crew member. Cause. I don't think any of the other crew members could survive this actually. I think they just keep dying to the lack of oxygen. Maybe you should upgrade our clone bay. Anything else? Wait, please just go around and check. Anything? Anything? No? Alright. Oh, we're ready to go. <laughs> oh boy. Let's see how far I can go with one crew member. A heavy damage, heavily damaged Federation ship is hiding in the nebula of this beacon. Before you have time to make contact with them, they fade into the nebula. Let's attempt to follow them. Your search is hopeless. Your sensors can't pick up anything in the nebula. That's kind of sad. You know what? We don't need oxygen. I've decided. We have a, the only crew member we have is Elenius, so we don't need oxygen. If you're naked without functioning sensors, you have expect a rebel ship to appear from behind a cloud at any moment, but none come. Yes, thank you. Store. The center of a hydrogen cloud doesn't seem like a very usual place for the store, but the NG aren't a usual species. Would it hurt to take a look? You know, this could be really useful. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Let's just replace the clone bay. But you know what? First order of business. Fixing everything here. Ooh, no longer the red. Thank you. You know, when I look at the swarm, it's basically over our enemies.
sell this guy. And you know what? Let's buy combat for when we can't, we like, we don't want to use a beam. Oh, that's another store. Very nice, very nice. But we just. Oh, it's an ion storm. You jump into a sector of the nebula beset by a plasma storm. An automated rebel scout station at the beacon moves into attack. Yo. How do you have so much. Like. Anything? That's crazy to me. You know what? We're saying that in the water. Let's get a combat drone up, that's it. At least it's only ion, they can't do hull damage. Oh, that's not good. Not good at all. Excuse me. Don't power down that flat can. I need that. Let's just focus on the shields. Very nice, very nice. Yay. We actually managed to get through that. How surprising. The ship explodes leaving behind scrap. <laughs> Let's jump out. Let's get out of here. Another plasma storm. A rock armored transport nearby looks to have lost their this bearing, so when they hail they when you hail they grow suspicious. Whatever life form you are, we find you repugnant. We see no aid. Leave now. Let's try. Since you're not doing it, since we have to know. Wow. Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You got this, you got this. The rock ship hails. Enough. We were told aliens were a threat to our ways and you have proved as much. Take this and leave us in peace. No surrender. I need the scrap. I'm sorry, I need to buy a crew member. Badly. Okay, okay, okay. Repairman, come help, please. He's so sad. It's very, very sad. I'm 
glad we got the combat shot though, honestly. Seems like a good idea. Seems to have been a good idea, rather. Please. Get your captain's chair. Your captain's chair. You find yourself surrounded by a group of mysterious alien vessels. They hail you in some technology for sale. Uh, you know, I really just want some crew members. Why would why would it, why would this happen? How could this happen? But you know what? We're definitely getting this. We're fixing ourselves up. And we're jumping away. <laughs> Neighbors are known to be popular mantis hunting grounds. Information you would have done well to heed here. Alright, let's bring up everything back online. Let's get their shields down. And let's bring up combat drill this time. Choosing all the wrong targets here. Which explodes. Scrap. Basically. Wow. <laughs> I'm sorry that you guys have to sit through this, but this is kind of the only way to keep the ship alive. Not gonna lie. And I'm not surprised that you've increased your repair speed, Mr. Declan. You have been the sole pilot, repair everything man on this ship. Must be kind of lonely, honestly. That time, you can travel around the star system a little bit more, get some more scrap. Navigating the fog blind, you practically bump holes with the mantis ship. They hail you. Pa! This transgression will be overlooked. Nebula, very dangerous. Next time, all humans die. There won't be a next time. Okay. Let's hit the beam. Senses anyway. Ooh, that's not good. Alright. Should explode. Very nice. Get that clone bay back online. I need that so badly. If Declan dies. over it just is but yeah I'm sorry this is all slow guys but this is the only way to keep us alive really it's kind of sad but yeah it's 
Let's keep going. Your ship emerges quite far away from the beacon. You see a rebel ship waiting nearby, and ultimately stationed to look for you. Let's attack that ship. Oh, that's not good. Uh, defense drones can't target anything, right? Nice. Very nice. Augmentation is really good, it turns out. Especially for if you're relying on drones. They offer to give you some of the goods if you don't destroy the ship. I'm sorry, I need the scrap. Thank you. You never see glance out the windows, but the only thing to greet you small clouds and silence very poetic nice i approve with the senses down you spend a good deal of time staring out the window it is you must admit rather beautiful here that line this game is such good writing honestly okay let's head over Hmm, neither of these are very good for the path, honestly. But let's head over to the NG homeworlds. See what we can find there. You have arrived in NG space. The fall of the Federation has brought tough times for these robotic life forms, but they're usually willing to help. Wow, this is depressing. I just see a whole sea of red. You see a number of NG space stations and fleet nearby. Despite looking like piles of junk loosely tied together, they are actually a model of efficiency. There is like certain aesthetic emphasis in their constructions. Cool. Let's go over here. You quickly come across a pirate in hot pursuit of an unidentified ship. You quickly receive a transmission from the pirate. Stay out of this fight, and it will make it worth your while. Let's try to be a hero. The pirate ship stops its pursuit and lost weapons onto your ship. Ooh, that's a pike beam. We cannot afford our sh for our shields to go down here. That would be extremely bad. Unfortunately, that seems exactly what it wants us to do. Oh wow, this is bad. They have a very high evasion rate. Proof a sufficient match for the pirates, they're powering up the FTL to try and get away. Fine, our previous offer was not generous enough. Let's not prove on it. The five fuel. Fine, let's take the five fuel. We need that fuel. I think that's it here. Wait, we're out of. Oh no. 
as soon as you jump into the system, receive a, a, say, a hail from a nearby civilian NG vessel. The captain appears on your screen. Strange bug can assist in debugging. Listen to the problem. What is that? What? Listen to that problem. It's been that you can't do any programming. And. So, I mean. Falma's functioning mantis believes it is human, will receive input only from human. Danger evaluation extremely high. Provide assistance. Sure. After an hour of convincing, the mantis finally calms down and introduces himself as Robert Smith. He explains he's from a nearby human colony and would, be appre would appreciate being returned there. The colony is a mining operation that specializes in FTL fuel. Robert's family, the head engineers, are excited to see him, and are very grateful for his return. Apparently he ran away to join the Federation, like his older brother, but was never accepted onto a ship. I want him on my ship. Thank you. And now I need oxygen. Very good. Thank you. Oh. Let's head to the store, and if we can't find what we need at this store, we can try the next store. <laughs> Energy ship hails. Engine upgrade necessary for travel home. Sale of equipment necessary for engine upgrade. Okay. We definitely want. Uh, wow, nice. Why wouldn't you take the better guy? Definitely buy him. I think we can effectively say that we're gonna s we can sell the Hermes now. And should I buy another crew member? Answer is probably yes, but I also want to buy the just chain laser. Be really good for us. But probably the crew member is more important right now. Let's put you on engine and your weapons. And we definitely need to buy Okay, that's all our scrap gone But We have a crew Houston, we have a crew <laughs> This is amazing The rebel fighter here would seem to suggest elements of the rebel fleet are already making incursions on NG space Move to engage Wow. It's been forever since we <laughs> actually had people. considerably more well armed than I would have thought. We surrender. That's not enough to make me surrender, my dude. We consider. Oh, 
on up. Wow. Now I really want to... Actually, I want more scrap in general, just set upgrades, really. But I think we need an extra power bar. We, either way, we'll need this. Let's hit this distress beacon then. We can head up. A ship without life forms within a nearby dense asteroid field is giving off a distress call. Shall we investigate? Let's search for the ship. We find what appears to be pieces of a derelict ship coated with ice or crystal. Before you have a chance to look, a few asteroids get past your shields and partially damage your engines. X. Those are probably Lanius, but fortunately, we couldn't help them. You arrive at a beacon and immediately detect a pirate ship. Seems this is just beacon. It was a trap. It's uh, a tarp. Uh, I don't know if you've heard of this before. But wow, this guy is really well equipped. Okay. Level 3 shields already. It's so very nice to have a crew. Let me just say that. Offer to give you some of the goods. Mm, that's not very much scrap. But I don't have any more drone parts, unfortunately. But one isn't gonna do anything. So the answer is no. So you couldn't get through. We're gonna get caught. Oh my goodness, I, I should just should have checked. The bull feet has found you. That's all we need to know, really. And what we need to do right now is escape. Use my last thing on that. Disaster. We really just need to get out of here as soon as possible. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Again, still caught. 
Ah, oh, same thing. Okay. This time it's not so bad though. Oh, it says doing the flat cannon. We will use this. so well. One last explosion marks your fate as your ship is torn apart. I'm sorry guys, that's where this run ended. I think we did pretty well honestly. We almost got away too. If I just had a missile stupid and gone up for that distress beacon, I think we could have made it. But either ways guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Please subscribe if you want and like if you please and I'll catch you all next time. See ya.